Hey guys, meteorologist Chris Tomer here on this Saturday morning. You know, looking at the forecast data this morning, it became obvious we've got a problem for the Wasatch coming. A rapid rise in temperature is coming to the Wasatch. Um, I even got one day where there's no refreeze for 24 hours. So here's the situation. I did a blog on this this morning. ChrisTomer.com. Rapid rise in temperature coming to Little and Big Cottonwood Canyons. It matters because we've seen 800 plus inches all-time record snow, and we've already seen evidence of this in the last few days with avalanches that are running all the way down to Highway 210 and beyond. Now we're going to overlay this rapid rise in temperature. Here's what I'm talking about. Forecast freezing levels. Maximum freezing level during the warmest part of the day. Today, 9,400 feet, so it's on the rise. 12,000 feet tomorrow. That's the 32-degree line. 131 on 410 and 411. That's way above even the highest peaks in the Wasatch Range, in the Wasatch Front. You have to go to the high Uintas to find higher peaks. Um, on Tuesday, 411, that's the warmest day of the bunch with potentially no refreeze. 24 7 uh, temps will be above freezing. 12 5, 412, down to, down to 11,000, but that's still high for the Wasatch Front on 413. Here's an idea of what I'm talking about. So this is 411, the warmest day of the bunch. Uh, maximum air temps. Um, you've got the, the valley, Wasatch, uh, the, the, the valley down in Salt Lake in the middle 70s. You've got Snowbird, Alta, the, all the ridge lines, the highest peaks in the 40s to about 50 degrees for high temperatures. And again, no refreeze that night for 99% of these places. So it is absolutely going to be a warm day. Let me just show you this, this map full screen. So again, forecast max air temps, 411 at 4 p.m., and you can see the numbers. Middle 70s through Salt Lake Valley and uh, 50s on top of the Wasatch Range, even the highest peaks. They're all going to be well above freezing all of those days. All right, guys, so there you go. I just uh, That jumped out to me this morning. Just wanted to do a video, did the blog on it as well. Um, I'll probably do something with this again tomorrow. This is such a significant... Uh, um, ordeal. I mean, we just we just haven't been in this situation before with so much snow, so much water content up there in, in both canyons, and now a rapid rise in air temperature. All right, guys, take care. Always appreciate you tuning in here. We'll talk later.